Welcome back to mine, Sega. So, I actually feel kind of stupid, because there's a lot of stuff I didn't realize was in this game, and I've been completely oblivious and just played normal Skyblock on here when they have so many possibilities that I didn't even know, like, knew existed. So let me just show you. Over here, there's a tutorial guy, and he shows, let me just say, a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff that this normal Skyblock this is all custom. This is like, I, okay, let me just show you. If you right click on this kit, you can see, welcome to the tutorial. I take, I take it you're new here, but don't fear. This tutorial will teach you everything you need to know about Mind Sega. So, first of all, they have achievements and missions. You can complete the missions slash achievements whilst playing and receive awesome rewards. So if we do slash missions, you see, I didn't know this was a thing. So, I will definitely try to complete some of these and see what, like, they give us. Next, Mining World. We already knew this, but you can travel to the Mining World and mine ores to receive cash. We already did this in the first episode, but I didn't really know what it was, but now I kind of know what it is. Island Ranks. You can give your island members very special permissions. I don't really have any island members, so that won't help me. Um, but... Envoys. Supply drops will fall regularly in the PvP arena and will be filled with awesome loot. Or PvP to visit the PvP arena. Now again, I did not know there was a PvP arena. Tiered hoppers. We have various tiers of hoppers that will have special benefits such as picking up all items in a chunk. See, that would have helped me with my iron golem farm, wouldn't it? That, that would have helped me a lot. Then... There's boosters. You can get boosters to speed up experience and money gain. Slash boosters for more information. They have economy boosters and experience boosters. And there's some information. You can unlock boosters by a store and get increased or money drops. Then they have bosses. You can fight monsters to earn epic rewards and prizes. Bosses. Cobblestone generators. Cobblestone generators will spawn various ores and rare mineral blocks that can help with your iron value. I cannot speak, but yeah, we already tried that in an episode and the, 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 the spawner didn't really go to plan. But they have crates. Uh, we have various different types of crates, such as boat, event, advanced, legendary, parkour, and dropper. Then they have delivery man. We already we already saw that, but we'll claim the deliveries in a second because I want to see if there's stuff. They have events, events for more information. They have gambling slash helo, I guess. Hi slash helo. They have generators. Generators will spawn material blocks or isle uh, or random rare items automatically on your island. I want to get one of these. I did not know what that was a thing. Machines. Machines can do various automatic misc tasks around your island. Look, again, I did not know there was a thing. Oh, I did not want to tell me sooner. Minions. They have minions. They have outposts. Oh, that's some more PP, all right. They have pets. Slash pets. Look, you can get turtle pet. Fishing while using this pet will give you some cool items. Like, they, they all give you extra stuff. Private mines. They have skills, they have mob stacking, they have tags, auctions, island value, and spawner upgrades. Do you think I knew all this? I didn't. I feel so stupid. But like, no, welcome to Mindsaker, where we actually have an idea of what the game like consists of. So I'm actually really excited for this episode. So be sure to like and subscribe if you haven't done already. Join Mindsega, play the Mindsega.org, the IP will be in the description. And be sure to check it out, because it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be very fun, alright? So the first thing I wanna do, I still wanna know what this does actually, but like, I, I don't know, it doesn't really do anything, so I think it's just for like, looks? I don't know, but let's see, we have six deliveries to claim. So, let's see what we have. We have a daily delivery. That was 25k coins and some shards. Then we have this thing that gives us 3 end portals and 5 basic shards. We have this thing that gives us more shards. More shards! More shards and more. And... So basically with these shards, you can do slash shards. And... Oh. And you get keys, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, here. 
you have received two basic, two legendary, two like two advanced and one legendary with nine left over and all this. So I think now we can do slash crates. There. And we have all the crates. I actually want to know how to get the Bakur crate. And they actually also have Vogue crate. So let me just get the Vogue crate real quick. I want to get the Vogue crate. And there we go. We have voted and we got some Vogue keys. And we have also been entered to the Vogue jackpot. Ooh. In 8 hours, 6 minutes. That's... I'm probably not on by that time. But, <laughs> you know. Oh, it's a Vogue party. Ah, I see. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. So let's... Let's take a moment to open all the crates. Alright, so... Slash crates. And we have three vote crates. We got a diamond helmet, a sword. Oh, that's way better than the sword we already had. And more shards. Then we have eight basic keys. Oh my god, that's a lot. The crates are kind of anticlimactic when you open them, but it's fine. We got we got an explode arrow trail. Ooh, blocks of iron, iron golem spawner. Another one. That's like 1.5 mil and cash. 1.5, like no, 100k cash. That's really cool. Wait, I wanna. <clears throat> Thank you. What is this? I want. I don't have a bow, but I guess I choose like stuff out of my bow when I shoot it. And then we got another iron golem spawner, which is insane. And the helmet is not better than my helmet, but it's new, so I'll take that on. And then we got some blocks, but we have more crates. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, two advanced crates. We get, we get these generator charms. A minion upgrade item. Ooh. I don't have any minions, but that's cool. A mi- <laughs> Okay. <laughs> we got a minion. We got a minion. Cool. So, now I want to go to my island. And I just want to... I just want to, like, check out the things we got. So, we still have in our chests some stuff. I don't know what these end portals actually do. But I know we have some of these somewhere. Yeah, we have there. No, that's page charm. That's generator charm. Well, that's two different items. So we actually got this minion egg. Um, I kind of want to try it. Minion upgrade item. We got two of these. And the spawner. So let me actually start off by placing the spawner. I just want to put all my irrelevant items away. There we go. I'm going to start off by placing a spawner in here. And... Oh. Oh yeah, I don't die by lava. Okay, good. <laughs> so let's just see. Uh, I'll need a block real quick. There we go. And there we go. And another spawner. Cool. So now with the spawner done, I want to place like this minion. So let's, uh, where's a good space for the minion? The minion should be around where we have stuff. So let's just place it here. You have successfully spawned a minion. Lumbox minion. Ooh, mode selection. So we can get it to attack. We can get it to idle. And we can go gen mode. What? I don't know what that is. So I think, I don't know what to do. Um, do we just keep it in idle? Yeah, we just keep it in idle. Because these are a little mine mode. Required level 2. Oh, wait, so I can put a minion upgrade slot? Level up. You can access more modes. Wow, now we have the mine mode. Okay, that's 4 mil. That's so expensive. That's really expensive. Let's upgrade it once more. And see, now we have everything unlocked. Oh my god, there's a lot of stuff here. I kind of want to do it in mine mode or in farm mode. I can't tell, but this is like kind of expensive. So we'll see if we can get like the money to do that soon i remember i still have these dungeon passes laying around and they give us money so let's go dungeons so let's try to do a dungeon by ourselves because i haven't tried that and these are i don't know how much damage these do but i'm gonna just try them and hopefully i'm not gonna embarrass myself like last time with like not being able to um do the parkour and i'm frozen i hate this frozen thing i think it's why why is that a thing i i don't like it i do not like the frozen thing so, let me just kill Frank here. Frank is uh, pretty annoying. And also this Frank. Why are they all Franks? I don't want to die by a Frank. Okay. No, 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 no. We don't like Franks here. At least don't these Franks. Because these Franks are scary. All other Franks are cool and epic. But these Franks... No, 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 no. So, you actually get one, like, uh, one mil from doing these. And I kind of need this one mil. And... Yeah. 
And also, I really, I'm really curious on how you get the generator, because I really want one of those. And I just need to get out of this maze real quick, because uh, I am not good at mazes. Okay, we're out. Let's just eat another golden apple and get ready to fight these. There are so many Franks here. Are there Franks again? Yeah, there are Franks again. <laughs> All right. And die. So I actually want to upgrade my island also. And that requires to place down blocks. So these blocks you need to place down, they are um, diamond blocks, emerald blocks, and all that. And they give you, like, island XP or island stuff. Um, that should make your island worth more somehow, I'm pretty sure at least. The frozen thing. Why is the frozen... I don't get the frozen thing. I don't like it. I dislike it, actually. That's one... That's, like... I really love this server, actually. And this... All this I just figured out today makes it way more exciting. But one thing I really dislike is the frozen thing. I don't know if that's on purpose or what that does. Or is, if it's a dungeon thing. Or is it a glitch? I don't know. But... Um, I might be wrong. I might be wrong. It might be a dungeon thing. But it's kind of weird. But otherwise, this... This... Dungeons is actually pretty entertaining. But I'm dying. And we got to be careful. Can I eat an apple? Yes. There we go. Why am I taking damage? There we go. Okay, parkour. I failed so many times. Wilcher, my stupid editor here, he made a channel called Lumbok Bloopers and just uploaded three minutes of me failing this parkour. <laughs> so, I mean... I mean... That's not very cool. That's very, um, I'm very offended because I'm really good at parkour. Bro, why? The frozen. Why? I don't get it. I don't get it. Is it, is it a thing? I don't get it. I really do not get it. And there we go. And you can actually jump down there, but I will do it from here. You can jump down. Oh my God. Oh my God. No, 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 no. This is not happening again. This is not happening again. This is not happening again. Okay. We got it. We got it. Oh my God. Nope. 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 We're all good. We're all good. Look at this. Oh my god, wait. Okay, listen. <laughs> listen. I'm not even doing this on purpose. I'm just a pro parkour. Oh my god. Okay. Calm. Calm, Lumbok. Calm, Lumbok. Calm. You can do this. This is not hard. This is an easy parkour. Wait, can I do this jump? I'm curious. Yep. And over there. And... Down there, over here, perfect. Just like first try, all right? First try, easy peasy, easy peasy, all right, cool. I really wanna get the money to use my minion, and if it's not in this episode, I get this, cause it's quite a lot of money. Uh, I'll probably get it for next episode, like the money to use it. And that I'm really excited for, I wanna know how they work. Cause like, it's a me minion, it's a Lombok minion, I had my face. Do you know how cool that it is? It's my Minecraft face. It's a Lombok minion. So now I think it's the last part of the... Um, I think it's the last part soon. When we get through this, I'm pretty sure there will be like a wave. Oh wait, there's a wave here. That's not what I thought. That's not what I thought. Okay. After this then, it will be the boss wave. And the boss wave will um, not be very cool because I'm alone. And last time I did this in the squad. And I really don't know if I'm strong enough to do this by myself. But we'll figure it out, I guess. We'll figure it out. So you don't take damage in lava, which is a plus from my end. Because um, I really don't like lava. And I don't really like this parkour because I suck at it. Okay. We're in the last part, I think. Wait, there's the boss. The boss is here. Where's the boss? I'll need to find the boss. Oh, it's over there. Alright. Okay, okay, okay. I just need to kill these. Okay. We're going to kill it. We're going to kill it. We're ready. We're ready to take on this boss. Wait, what if I get it in the lava like they did? Because I don't take damage in lava, but does this one take damage in lava? Come here. Oh, I'm frozen. I'm frozen. Please. Please. This is not the time to freeze me. This is not the time to freeze me. This is really not the best time to freeze me. Can you come down here, please? Yes. Yes. Come here. Why am I frozen again? Okay, it's fine. Oh, wait, that's perfect. Like that. Okay, now we just click very fast. Now we just click very fast. And sorry to say, you're dead. Cool. We got shards also, wait. So they're envoys. And envoys you got by warp PvP, right? So that's warp PvP. I, I just really wanna see if I can find it. I don't really know what they look like, but I saw somebody collect them in chat, so I'm curious. Click to claim. 
Oh, okay. I've already claimed this. So wait. I, oh, I'm claiming this right now. Okay, so there's one over here. So let's go over here real quick. This is cool. So you have to protect them while you like. Oh wait. So I have to wait till this one. All right. That's fine. That's fine. I need to look if there's more because these are good. These are good. And he got a legendary envoy or she. I don't know. He or she. But they got a legendary envoy, and I really want a legendary, you know? Because, like, what does a legendary contain? They got another legendary! Bro! This is not gonna be legendary. I got all commons. Yes. Exactly what I wanted. Exactly what I wanted. All common. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Let's just go to our island real quick. And you're home. There we go. Alright, so what I said earlier with value is, you can see here there's value. My island is currently no value. So if you mine down here, under the whole island thing, we have these. And um, if we fast place them, level 3, then it should increase my island value. I don't know if sponge does, but this should actually... Increase my island value by just a little bit. I'll have to figure that one out. I'll have to figure that one out. So, also one thing it was the missions. So let's just, before we end up like ending it, complete a mission. So we need to mine 32 gold ores. We can do that. Place 10 gold blocks, craft a golden apple, and craft gold leggings. Alright, so we need an apple. So how many do we have to mine? We have to mine 32, right? 32 perfect. So now we can just like spawn and we got this stuff. We got this stuff. So now we can go to our island and we'll need to buy some gold. So shop. Let me just buy miscellaneous shop. Nope. Or shop. Yes. Let's just buy 10 of these. So let's place that. So that's one. Oh, I think that placed it. So here's the apple. Apples, am I right, chat? And the leggings. And we got the mission. Gold one. So now... What do we get as a reward? Oh. Oh, wait. You have to craft them all. Oh, so we have to do them all. And we don't have 500 skeletons. That's... How do you get skeletons? I don't know. Well, okay. I think we learned a bunch of stuff today. And I'm really excited now. Because this... I'm stupid. I, I'm really stupid. I didn't know there was this much in it. And I heard people complaining about like, Oh my god, he's trash. He's a trash YouTuber because he doesn't know how to play the game. And like, yeah. No, I know how to play the game now. I'm pretty sure at least. So there's a lot of stuff we'll need to do. And there's a lot of stuff I have in mind. And we really want to look into getting that generator. However we do it. But I think uh, this was what I had for this episode. So if you enjoyed it, be sure to like and subscribe, turn on notifications, and I will just see you in the next episode. Okay, bye!